you know, we have a Lion King billboard up here while we're here on the Spider-Man carpet. How are you even balancing everything right now? It's, you know, these, these productions take a long time. I've been working on Lion King for three years. I've been working on the chef show for three years and, 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 and this one, Spider-Man Far From Home, for like two years they've been working on it. It just so happens that they're all hitting at the same time. But for three years I've had a nice relaxing ride of just going to work every day. So it's exciting, it's fun. It's fun to come out and uh, put on a suit and tie and see the people that you uh, that you worked with and that you you share so much in common with, you bonded with, and it becomes like a reunion. And so these events are are fun. It's fun and glamorous, but but really what you grow to appreciate is the community and everybody getting to see each other and share these share these memorable moments together. Um, of course, happy is more important than ever in Peter's life in this yes, film. Yes. Um, what was it like getting to spend that extra time with Tom and and kind of fill that role? Well, I think thanks to, thanks to John Watts, the director filling us in on all the specific details of the of what was leading up to this because remember Endgame wasn't out yet so and, and Endgame was actually still kind of shooting around the same time so to hear what my character had been through and what Peter Parker had been through uh, it, it definitely changed the relationship between between our two characters you know in the beginning I was kind of a little annoyed by him and I was I was like a babysitter assigned to look after him in the background of what was happening uh, during Civil War but now, you know, after after Infinity War and Endgame, um, we had been through all the characters been through a lot emotionally, and so what I like what this relationship has evolved to, and of course to work with an actor like Tom Holland with scenes that are both funny and also emotional is great because I don't get to act like this that often. So being involved with something like this that I'm so proud of to be involved with, and to work with a guy like him, it's what I started off doing, and, and I and I and I definitely appreciate the opportunity. I just remember that Gwyneth didn't remember being in Spider-Man from the Chef Show. Is that, have, has there ever been one of these that you don't remember or didn't know what you were shooting? I think I think with the Marvel things, there was there's definitely a lot of um, they have so many films happening at the same time, and all of them interweave with one another. Uh, you're like I remember during the the in the in the big scene in Endgame, we were all told it was a wedding. Yeah. So you know, oftentimes you're not exactly sure uh, what what's happening. And even me, who's you know, I'm I'm an executive producer on Endgame. I didn't always know what was going on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank you so much. Thank you.